Today's video is on vertex related subgraphs. In my previous videos, I have explained what are graphs, subgraphs, induced subgraphs. And in today's video, I'm going to explain what is this vertex related subgraph. And in my upcoming video, I'm going to post edge deleted subgraph. So please don't miss these videos and it will be very, very helpful for your preparation. See here, what is the graph here? Let G, V, comma, E be a graph. So V are the set of vertices, set of points, E set of lines or edges so if the points and lines all together make a graph so g is the main graph with few vertices and edges v1 belongs to v so v1 belongs to v the subgraph of g obtained by removing the vertex vi so we have to remove certain vi and all the edges incident with vi so we have to remove all the edges which are incident with vi is called the vertex deleted subgraph and it is denoted by g minus vi so they are set of vertices so out of all the vertices i'm going to remove this vi so before removing this VI, so I have to remove all the edges which are instant with VI and the new graph which is formed is called the vertex deleted subgraph. Clear? So let me explain you with an example here. So for the graph G given below, draw the subgraph G minus VI and G minus V7. So VI is nothing but the vertex and v7 is also the vertex see let me show you the main graph here so this is the main graphs which is having the vertices v1 v2 v3 v4 v5 v6 and v7 so in between these are all the edges e1 e2 e3 e4 till e12 are the edges so they are vertices and edges which are making a graph so this is the main graph g so now what is the question here i want to remove this vertex v1 so this is v my g minus v1 so where is v1 here so v1 is there so before removing this v1 vertex so i have to remove all the edges which are incident with v1 so how many edges are there so this is uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. I have to remove all the vertices which are instant with V1. And the fresh graph which is formed is called vertex deleted subgraph. So here is V1. I have removed all the vertices, all the edges which are instant with V1. So this is the new graph. So in this graph, we have the remaining vertices that is V2, V3, V4, V5. So this is V6 and V7. So only V1 is missing and along with V1, the edges which are incident to V1 are also missing. So clear? So this is nothing but vertex deleted subgraph. So this is a subgraph and V1 is missing and along with V1, all the edges. So here all the edges are also deleted. So after deleting the vertex and all the edges which are instant with V1 are all deleted and this is the fresh graph and this is called the vertex deleted subgraph. And here is an another example. See here. So this is the main graph G. So as it is very clear and the second question is we have to remove vertex V7 from the main graph G. So V7 we have to remove. See here, if you observe this one, where is V7? So V7 is this one. So as you can see that they are the vertices that is V1, V2, V3, V4, V5 and V6. And V6, so they are seven vertices. And out of this seven vertices, we have to remove this V7. So if we remove this V7, we have to remove all the edges edges which are instant with v7 how many edges are there this is one this is two and this is three so we have to remove three edges and this vertex point so this will be the graph so i have removed this one two and three so this is the graph and this is the fresh graph which is nothing but this is g minus v7 so this is the subgraph so this is nothing but the vertex deleted subgraph so hope you all guys understand thank you so much for watching and staying till the end if you really like this video please uh, look at my next video that is edge dele deleted subgraph and it will be very very easy and it will be very helpful for your preparation please pass it on to your friends if you really like and subscribe to this channel for more videos thank you so much